decarbonization pushing down carbon emissions. The World Economic Forum predicts a $13.5 trillion investment by 2050 for decarbonization, aiming to transition key sectors to achieve net zero emissions targets through clean power, hydrogen production, and carbon capture technologies. Servotec leads Green Push in collaboration with National Solar Energy Federation of India. Servotec Power Systems Limited, a leading manufacturer of EV chargers and solar solutions, in collaboration with the National Solar Energy Federation of India, inaugurates Delhi's first grid-connected solar-powered EV charging carport. Trelleborg expands hydrogen testing capabilities. Trelleborg Sealing Solutions opens a new facility in Fort Wayne to assist customers in overcoming obstacles of hydrogen storage and transport. SR Energy Transition launched EET Hydrogen Power. SR Energy Transition Hydrogen Power announced the development of Europe's first 100% hydrogen-powered power plant, aiming to reduce emissions and contribute to decarbonization in the UK. Indosolar inaugurates solar module facility. Indosolar, a subsidiary of Wari Energies, has launched its 1.3 gigawatt solar module facility in Noida, creating new jobs and nurturing India's solar energy sector. Raise Power Infra creates a subsidiary to manufacture solar solutions. Raise Power Infra established a 100% owned subsidiary dedicated to manufacturing solar modules, solar cells, and battery energy storage systems at a gigawatt scale.